Hello everybody, it is Saturday, March 27th, and here are your national days. It is Quirky Country Music Song Title Day, and this is just a fun one because they have some great song titles. I'm just going to give you two, but this is just a short example of what's out there, alright? So here's the first one. I still miss my baby, but my aim's getting better. <laughs> All right, so you got that one, or you're the reason our kids are so ugly. So um, they definitely have some fun with, with some of those titles, and uh, see what's out there, because there's a lot more than just those. Uh, especially check out some of those uh, 80s, uh, late 70s too, for, to, to some extent. Good morning, everybody. It is Saturday, March 27th, and here are your national days. It is Quirky Country Music Song Title Day, and this one's just a fun one. If you've never taken a look at some of the country music song titles, you need to. All right, I'll just give you two, but there's, the list is so much longer as to how good some of these can be. So uh, the first one is, I still miss my baby, but my aim's getting better. And then the second one is, you're the reason our kids are so ugly. So, oh, they have some fun, I'll tell you what. So uh, go check them out and see what else you can find, because there are some good ones out there. Uh, it is Joe Day, so if you know anybody named Joe, it's their day. Celebrate them and, um, you know, do something fun with them. Maybe give Joe a cup of Joe. I don't know. All right, so see what you can what you can figure out out there. It's Scribble Day, and the whole idea of Scribble Day is that uh, kids sometimes look at art and say, "Oh, art's hard," but just even the simplest scribble can be turned into something cool. Just put some faces on it, and that's the whole idea behind the the uh, the attempt to get kids to create art. So Scribble Day. It's World Theater Day, so if you have the opportunity where you are to go to a theater. Go, absolutely support them 100%. Uh, but if you don't, maybe we can, you can find an outdoor theater that might be doing something or go take, uh, take in something online where they might be presenting something in a theater that you can, can then uh, support. All right, and uh, last but not least, it is Spanish Paella Day. And this is that wonderful rice, seafood, saffron. Sometimes you get some kind of other meat in there, whether it be like a, a sausage, kibasi, whatever it is. Oh, just tasty, and uh, definitely something I look for on restaurants when I have the opportunity to get it. Um, and uh, just so good, so, so good. If you've never had it, definitely check it out, If you like, especially if you like seafood. All right, so those are all of our days. Let's take a look at our fact of the day. An espresso maker was sent into space in 2015. So Samantha Criscio Ferretti uh, is the first female Italian astronaut uh, and she, she wanted something to uh, kind of make the place feel more like home. So the Italian Space Agency worked with the Italian coffee maker La Vaza to get coffee capsules flown up uh, and into space. So there you go. They should have coffee. I'm, I mean, you're on an international space station. You should definitely have coffee. All right. So um, there you go, everybody. Those are your days. Those are your facts. Hopefully you have a great day. And we'll see you right back here tomorrow. Have a good one, everybody.